Welcome to Atlanta, Ruby. How are you settling in? This yeah, week? thanks. It's nice to be here. Um, a bit different than South Africa, but I'm um, settling in quite nice. And our team manager, Tim Olnott, picked you up from Dublin Airport last Friday. Um, you had some time to get to know your surroundings while the team were in Italy. What were your first impressions? I know it's your first time in Ireland. What were your first impressions? Yeah, no, it's a, it's a beautiful country. Um, Tim uh, got us at the airport and we drove here. It was about a two hours drive. Um, beautiful countryside, it's a beautiful country, but different than South Africa the weather was. But um, yeah, no, it was good. And you've moved over with your wife, Monique, but uh, it wasn't just the two of you coming over on the plane. Who else was with you? <laughs> yeah, it was definitely um, our, our little dog um, came with, English Bulldog, um, Jack. Um, if I left him in South Africa, I'd probably be sitting here alone. So, keeping the wife happy. Um, so, yeah, we brought him over as well. And how's he enjoying? Yeah, he's, boy? He's, yeah he's life in Galway for him is, is sleeping. That's what he does best. So, um, yeah, he's, he's enjoying it quite, quite good. And rugby wise, you're fit and ready to go. Obviously, you haven't played as much rugby as you would have liked in the past few weeks, but you must be really ready to get going now. Yeah, definitely. I think um, every player wants to play. Um, the last couple of weeks I haven't played that much, um, so I'm ready to go. I'm fit, um, declared fit, and um, yeah, now it's going well in training wise. So yeah, hopefully in the next couple of weeks I might get a shot um, to be in the in the team. And obviously, there's a lot of work for you to do, getting up to speed with the calls and all the plays. Has that been uh, stressful or have you had some help from the boys and the coaches? Yeah, the, the boys are, are very helpful and the coaches as well. Yesterday I had a meeting with um, Coach McPhillips as well, um, getting me up to speed, with, but it's going to take a, take a bit. Um, generally, it's, there's not as much calls in South Africa, but yeah, it's, it's part of the rugby, it's part of my homework. So as, as soon as I get up to speed, then um, obviously I'll make it life for myself a bit easier. Great, and you have your first main pitch session today, are you looking forward to that? Yes, definitely. Um, I've been ready to go. Um, the week's been been quite mild um, with, the guy, with the boys coming back from their travel to Italy. So yeah, no, I'm happy to get on the pitch and um, yeah, see how it, how it works all out, outside and I'm um, ready to go. And it's pretty windy out there today, but have you had a chance to practice some goal kicking on the, on the pitch? Yes, I did actually on Monday when the boys went here. Um, it's quite, quite different from South Africa, the wind and the rain. I um, had a session yesterday as well, so yeah, I know it's, it's going to take a bit of time to get used to, but um, yeah, I'll probably figure it out. Great, and you have a lot of obviously super rugby experience coming over here and a lot of experience in the Curry Cup. Um, you said you've been watching a lot of the Connacht games. Have you noticed a big difference in the style of play or, or what are the, the similarities from your own game? Yeah, I think um, in all the hemisphere teams normally uh, play a lot different than the southern hemisphere. Um, but I think uh, Connacht has, uh, has a very big um, uh, emphasis on, a, on maybe a running game um, that you wouldn't normally see from all the hemisphere teams. So um, yeah, no, it's, it's quite an exciting team to watch and uh, uh, there's different ideas and, and play, good quality players that uh, execute the plans quite well. Um, very good. We have a big game this week with uh, Leinster v Connacht in the ODS. Will you be looking forward to going up and watching that? Yeah, definitely. I'll travel with the team and I'm quite excited to see how the things work. Um, I think obviously if you play um, locally then it's, it's always tough. Um, Leinster are one of the bigger clubs in, in Ireland so I think it's going to be a big challenge for, for the boys on Saturday. Great. Well, we uh, will catch up with you soon and uh, great. Welcome to Connacht. Thank you so much.